A clothing drive with a much deeper meaning. April is Sexual Assault Awareness Month, and one UW-Madison freshman started a project for sexual assault survivors. With the help of other groups on campus and local hospitals, she is able to put the needs of others first. NBC 15's Cameron Kelly learned about the history of this special clothing drive, Cameron. Elizabeth freshman Jessica Randall is a survivor herself. She created this project in high school, collecting new underwear, shirts, and more. Randall says helping people who are in a vulnerable position matters the most. I started this project a couple years ago when I was a junior in high school, and originally I just thought it was going to be a short-term, one-week drive, and then I would donate to hospitals, but over time, the need for this has uh, been more apparent. UW-Madison freshman Jessica Randall created a clothing drive for sexual assault victims whose clothes are taken for evidence. And most hospitals don't have supplies to send them home in comfortable clothes and even underwear. So oftentimes they're sent home in paper scrubs and disposable underwear. Randall says no matter your race, gender, ethnicity or identity, everyone knows at least one person affected. Even if it just impacts one person a week, that's enough to know that these survivors are going home with comfortable clothes on because that's just another injustice on top of the fact that they were assaulted if we're sending them home and labeling them as they walk out of the hospital. Randall says during the first drive on campus, she received monetary gifts. She says they also take new clothes and underwears of all sizes. The next drive is on April 26. If you would like to know more about this project and how you can help, visit NBC15.com. Live in the studio, Cameron Kelly, NBC15 News.